What if Michael Jackson's famous trial in 2005 was actually just a big, giant misdirection for two of the most predatory monsters in history? As the king of pop faced legal troubles, headlines became a smokescreen, all to conceal lawsuits and allegations of abuse against Harvey Weinstein and Jeffrey Epstein. We would later find evidence that Weinstein used TV host AJ Benza to trade hot gossip about MJ to the tabloids in exchange for limiting coverage on himself. If Harvey was doing that, what do you think a master manipulator like Jeffrey was up to at the time? While the world fixated on Jackson's legal spectacle, Weinstein's predatory escapades thrived in the shadows and Epstein's insidious network operated with virtual impunity. But don't take my word for it. Do your own research and let me know. You still trust the media puppet masters pulling the strings in the theater of public perception. What if Michael Jackson's famous trial in 2005 was actually just a big, giant misdirection for two of the most predatory monsters in history? As the king of pop faced legal troubles, headlines became a smokescreen, all to conceal lawsuits and allegations of abuse against Harvey Weinstein and Jeffrey Epstein. We would later find evidence that Weinstein used TV host AJ Benza to trade hot gossip about MJ to the tabloids in exchange for limiting coverage on himself. If Harvey was doing that, what do you think a master manipulator like Jeffrey was up to at the time? While the world fixated on Jackson's legal spectacle, Weinstein's predatory escapades thrived in the shadows and Epstein's insidious network operated with virtual impunity. But don't take my word for it. Do your own research and let me know. You still trust the media puppet masters pulling the strings in the theater of public perception.